Oh, by the way, well, guess what Mrs. Bobby Adler, the loin of my fruits, suggested to me this afternoon. Um, stop calling me the loin of your fruits? <laughs> no, honey, she said that you and Grace should get married. <laughs> Grace and me. <laughs> married. It was just a suggestion. I think it's a wonderful idea. She'll make such a beautiful bride. Grace, you look pretty, too. Oh. <laughs> This would be us three weeks in. Honey, I'm having an affair. Me too. His name is Donald. Me too! <laughs> <laughs> Can't you just hear it? Will, you may now kiss the beard. <laughs> I mean, it's so absurd. Even if I was straight, I wouldn't marry Grace. <laughs> What did Will mean by that? I mean, if I were gay, I would marry him. I mean, if I were a gay man, and I lived in Amsterdam, or ancient Greece, and you know what I mean. But honey, maybe you're just needy. You see, when you're with a man, what you need to do is to oh, find out what no, he is. Oh, no, 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 thank you. Anything but relationship advice from you. Why? Ladies, are you ready to order? Uh, I'm not, I'm not eating. And your sister. Sister? <laughs> well, honey, I mean, I love you. <laughs> I'll have an order of you to go. <laughs> Why don't I give you ladies a few minutes to decide? Oh, that's cute, cute. Why won't I take your advice? That's why. Well, what was I gonna do, dear? Ignore him? He was flirting with me. It's my youthful skin. It's the only thing that dreadful grandmother of yours gave me. Mom, Mom, what, I, what I'm trying to say to you is that you always need to be the center of attention. In, in a restaurant, in your marriage, you always have to be the star. God cast me in the role. <laughs> You know, Will has a theory about relationships. One person is the gardener who tends, and the other person is the flower who gets tended to. And mom, I say this with love. You're a big stinking rose. Sorry, ladies, my turn to be late. No, oh, you're just in time. My daughter's hating me for lunch. Ah. I don't hate you, I hate you. This is gonna be a pleasant lunch. What's everybody having? I'm not eating. My mother's having the snapper, and why the hell wouldn't you marry me? <laughs> Can I at least have a breadstick first? <laughs> why wouldn't you marry me? You're just not my type of woman, okay? I prefer someone taller and uh, with a hairy chest. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny. <laughs> well, ignore me. Keep going. You said specifically that if you were straight, you wouldn't marry me, and I'm just curious as to why, huh? Why, huh? Why, huh? All right, I'm not gonna talk to you when you're like this, okay? Okay, okay, you're right, you're right. I'm, I, I, I'm just overreacting. But look, I really think it would be good for me to know, so, so please, tell me. It's nothing. It's nothing to do with our relationship. It has more to do with the way you are with your boyfriends. Do you really want to discuss this in front of your mother? Oh, please. I used to take your temperature in the tushy. <laughs> nothing shocks me. Just ignore me. Go. <laughs> how am I with my boyfriends? Well, you know how you are. Well, obviously I don't. How am I? Will? OK. You have a tendency you kind of need to be the star of your relationships, you know? I mean, it's, it's all about your stuff. Your boyfriends are like gardeners, and, and you're sort no, of like... No, 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 no. Do not call me a flower. I am not a flower. I am a gardener, damn it. I do plenty of hoeing. That's just what a mother likes to hear. <laughs> 
Okay, okay, you know what? You know what? I think I am just, I am done with this, this lovely lunch. I do not have to sit here and be criticized and insulted by my best friend. That is why my mother is in town. Grace, you asked me a question. You are describing the wrong person at this table. I, I, I am giving and nurturing and, and loving and selfless with my boyfriends. I, Will Truman, am no star. 